Hello everyone welcome back to my channel. Recently, there has been buzz surrounding a statement made by Al Sudani regarding the potential strength of the dinar against the dollar. He suggested holding on to the dinar, implying it could outshine the dollar in value. However, the current exchange rate of 76 cents per dinar may seem contradictory to this assertion. But is there more to the story than meets the eye? Let's delve deeper into this matter. Firstly, it's essential to understand the dynamics of exchange rates and what factors influence them. Exchange rates are determined by various economic factors such as inflation, interest rates, government debt, and political stability. Additionally, the real effective exchange rate, RIR, takes into account not just one currency pair but a basket of currencies, providing a more comprehensive view of a currency's strength. Al Sudanese statement suggests a belief in the potential for the dinar to appreciate significantly against the dollar, while the current rate of 76 cents per dinar might not reflect immediate strength. It's crucial to consider the broader context and potential factors at play. One factor to consider is the real effective exchange rate. The rear takes into account inflation and adjusts the exchange rate based on a country's relative price levels compared to its trading partners. Therefore, even if the nominal exchange rate seems low, the rear could paint a different picture, potentially showing the dinar as undervalued against a broader currency basket. Moreover, geopolitical factors play a significant role in currency valuation, stability, economic policies, and global trade relationships all influence investor sentiment and, consequently, exchange rates. If Al Sudanese statement reflects confidence in Iraq's economic prospects and stability, it could bolster investor confidence and, in turn, contribute to dinar appreciation. It's also essential to consider the historical context. The Iraqi dinar has had a tumultuous journey, particularly in the aftermath of the Gulf War and the subsequent economic sanctions imposed on Iraq. However, in recent years, Efforts to stabilize the currency and improve economic conditions have been underway, potentially laying the groundwork for future appreciation. Furthermore, central bank policies and interventions can impact exchange rates. If the central bank of Iraq implements measures to support the dinar or manages monetary policy effectively, it could influence its value relative to other currencies, including the dollar. In conclusion, while the current exchange rate of 76 cents per dinar may not seem indicative of immediate strength against the dollar, it's essential to consider a broader range of factors. Factors such as the real effective exchange rate, geopolitical stability, economic policies, and historical context all play a role in shaping currency valuations. Al Sudanese statement should be viewed within this broader context as it may reflect optimism about Iraq's economic prospects and potential for dinar appreciation in the future. Ultimately, only time will tell whether the dinar will surpass the dollar, but understanding the complexities of exchange rates provides valuable insights into this ongoing discussion. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more information.